In this video, I'm going to be installing Fedora Linux 41 beta version in a desktop computer. So here I'm going to choose the language. I'll click continue. I'll select the hard drive. I'll click done and I'll begin installation. I'll click finish installation. So I'm going to restart the computer. I'll click on start setup. I'll turn location services off. I will enable third party repositories. I'll type a name. I'll type a password. I'm going to skip the tour. So I'm going to open the terminal app. I'm going to run an upgrade. I'll type sudo dnf upgrade. So I'm also going to run an update. I'll type sudo DNF update. So on the dock is Firefox. So this is the version of Firefox 130.0.1. So I'm going to right click the desktop. I'll click on change background. I'm going to change the theme to dark mode. So these are some of the background wallpapers. So this is the calendar. This is the files manager app. I'll open this PDF document. So this opens with image viewer. So this is the software app. 
So they are all listed by categories. These are other categories. So there's explore, there's installed, and these are all the installed apps. This is updates. So I'm going to download the updates. I'm going to search for Chrome. I'll install Chrome. So this is the text editor. So there's camera contacts, there's a weather app. This is the clock app. This is maps. So this is the Media Writer app. So LibreOffice is installed. This is the Videos app. This is the Calculator app. This is the document scanner app. I'll open the system monitors app. And it's broken down by CPU, memory and swap, network and disk. This is boxes. And you can create new virtual machines here. So this is utilities and these are some of the utilities apps. I'll open the disk cap. So the size of the hard drive in a desktop computer is one terabyte. I'll open the Connections app. And this is the connection type, RDP or VNC. This is the Rhythm Box. I'll open the Settings app. Uh, so this is Netbook.
So I can set up a VPN here. I can add a proxy. This is Bluetooth. This is displays. This is the sound settings. This is the power settings. I can configure the power saving settings here. This is the power button behavior settings. This is multitasking. This is appearance. This is apps. So I can configure the default apps. This is the notification settings. So I can configure app notifications for all these apps. This is the search settings. This is online accounts and you can configure an online account here. I'll click on Google. This is sharing, and you can configure file sharing here. You can turn this on. This is mouse and touchpad. This is the keyboard settings. This is the color settings. This is printers, and here you can add printers. This is the accessibility settings. This is privacy and security. This is system. It is also remote desktop. I'll open the terminal app again. So I'm going to check the kernel version. I'll type the uname dash r. So the kernel version is 6.11. So I'm going to install htop. I'll type sudo dnf install htop. I'll open htop. So I'm going to run this command to check the desktop environment. I already know it's GNOME, so I'll type echo paste dollar sign xdg, and this is an all caps underscore current underscore desktop, so it's GNOME. And to check what version of GNOME it is, I'll type GNOME dash shell space dash dash version. So the version of GNOME is 47. So I'm going to install GIMP. I'll type sudo dnf install GIMP. So I'm going to open GIMP. So you can get more information in Fedora's website. And you can see some of the changes here. They are listed.
So I want to thank you for watching and I thank you for subscribing.